What's up, Montreal? I'm your host and best friend, Alex Melky, coming to you from the Notre Dame Basilica. Let's get jiggy with it. Now, I like to keep the stories light on Anchorman MTL because I'm here to entertain, but this has been a crazy week for Canada. First, 53-year-old soldier Patrice Vincent is killed in a hit and run in Quebec. Then, 24-year-old Corporal Nathan Cirillo was shot at point-blank rage while standing guard at the National War Memorial in Ottawa. The shooter got into Parliament but was shot down by Sergeant at Arms and badass Kevin Vickers, who received a standing ovation for two minutes straight upon returning to Parliament the very next day. Now, a few people on my Facebook and Twitter feed posted that the events on Parliament Hill that day changed Canada forever. This doesn't change anything. Canada remembers those that fell and we forge on. We don't sensationalize, we don't jump to conclusions, and we don't act irrationally. We just keep being what we are. Fucking awesome Canadians. Moving on. On a lighter note, Halloween is just around the corner and everybody is getting their costumes ready, including the Montreal Canadiens. Now, every group of friends has that one friend who just goes a little crazy with the costume. And for the Habs, that's P.K. Subban. Montreal makeup artist Lisa Marie Charon dished out her skills to turn the Habs player into the zombified Michael Jackson from Thriller. Carrie Price's costume may have been a bit more basic, but it's still hilariously awesome. I'm Mary Poppins with a beard, the hottest Halloween costume of 2014. Now, Halloween isn't all fun and games, it's also spooky. But you know what else is spooky? Montreal. This city has seen its fair share of gruesome murders, unsolved mysteries, horrible crimes, and ghosts. Most of these all went down in the old port. And the Montreal Ghost Tour is going to take you around to every single spooky spot. And if you've got the guts, they're holding a very special Halloween ghost walk where you can hunt some ghosts for yourself, spanning from October 30th all the way to November 1st. Check out all the spooky details at mtlblog.com if you dare. Now this ghost is the ghost of Halloween trash. Oh fuck, it's leaking on me, that's disgusting. Now every week at mtlblog.com, I go through all your Instagram pictures looking for shots in Montreal that are just goddamn gorgeous. And this week, Instagrammer Explorizon went to some ridiculous heights for an insane shot of the city. So check out Explorizon's account and follow MTL Blog's Instagram account. And the next time that you're snapping pics in Montreal, hashtag MTL Blog, and it might just be in next week's video. Now that's gonna be it for this week's episode of Anchorman MTL. Make sure to share, like, and subscribe to find out just what the hell is going on in Montreal. And check out MTLBlog.com for 13 Montreal metro stations you love to hate, six Montreal-made meals you need to eat with champagne, 27 ways living in Montreal ruins your life, but in the best way possible, and the latest and greatest of what this city has to offer. Now I'm off to talk to some of my biggest fans. See you next week, Montreal. So this is Cinderella. She's one of my biggest fans in Eric Man MTL, and she has uploaded several of the best Instagram pictures I've picked. So I just want to say thank you for watching every episode.